Hello everyone. Welcome back to Journey to Wisdom and Wealth. My name is Tara. If you're new, welcome. If you're not new, welcome back. Thank you so much for joining me. I truly do appreciate you. If you're not new here, you know you're already part of the what? Grateful gang, gang, gang. Grateful gang, 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 gang. Grateful gang, gang, gang. Grateful gang, 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 gang. And if you're not a part of the Grateful Gang, we'd love to have you. Be very grateful to have you over here. If you like budgeting videos, doing first-time own home ownership type things, as well as vlogs here and there, then consider hitting the subscribe button. We'd love to have you. Like I said, if you're OG gang, Grateful Gang member, then please go ahead and don't forget to hit the like button and also make sure your notification bell is turned off and leave me a comment down below y'all know i like to talk to you guys all right so let's get into today's video which is going to be unstuffing restuffing and also um changing out our system because this is not it's not doing it for your girl anymore so let's just get started first with unstuffing because we took the credit card out it seems that we have less money these are all my receipts. I need to leave them out over there so I can scan them. We have less money left, which is a good thing because that means we're using the cash that we're allocating out of the cash rather than on the credit card. It's not a good thing because we still have to pay the credit card back for some things, but overall it's great. So this is where all the change is now because there's no money left in allowance. Gas, all the money is messed up because I took money out to give, I gave my grandma like 20 bucks. Then I took money out to buy her something that she wanted for the house. And then, so none, none, none of the money is where it really supposed to be. Look, there's when I got groceries, so now there's extra money there. Um, bulk toll trees is empty. Chick-fil-A is the rest of the giving money and then back there we'll revisit in a minute so i'm not even going to tell you how much we had left in here there or anywhere because it would not be completely accurate so let's just in general see what we have left i will tell you the most money was left in gas i still have a half of a half a tank of gas and um we're about it's on it's sunday so i'm gonna rock that out for a little bit till we get to about quarter tank and then i'll refill so i know we had like 30 or 40 dollars left in gas anyway so we have 20 30 40 50 55 56 57 58 59 60 61 62 63 we have 63 dollars Leftover, which is amazing. So we're going to put that aside for now and we'll decide what we're doing that in a moment with that in a moment So as I said you guys this system is no longer working for me So let me show you what I'm switching for I will switching to I will go over and see what receipts are expired and throw things away um, And get this emptied out empty out the cards and the, the rest of the credit cards that are in there and move them over to the new system so if you watched my Amazon Prime haul the other day, you would have seen that I picked this up. Shout out to budget the ba Budgeting the Bag, Crystal over there on her channel. She had this on her channel, and that's what she was using for her division, her dividing section. They are not actually... Okay, this is what the... You get two of these. I'd already started putting my stickers on. So you get little clear stickers with your headings for your dividers on it. You get a choice of, I think, about three or four colors. It comes in a black, a blue, a few other colors. Um, blue, greenish color. I chose the tan, but to be honest, you guys, this looks super small to me. And yes, maybe you could fit it in, but I think I'm going to end up using this as like a really cute eyeglass, sunglass case, putting in my car and put one of my sunglasses that I'm rocking at the time in my car because I think that's too small. So here are what the dividers look like. I thought it would save time if I went ahead and put um, my headings on already and we'll go over those in a moment. But this, the dividers come clear, completely clear, and then you choose the stickers that you wanna work with. Um, <clears throat> so next, so let me tell you what I am gonna use. So I actually went to Marshalls and I had found a nice Tahari um, wallet. But as I was doing it, I was like, I was just about to ring out and it was like $12.99, great price. So if you're looking for a new wallet, definitely check out your TJ Maxx, Marshalls, all those places. I was about to do it and then I was like, wait a minute, your sister bought you a wallet that you haven't even used and she bought it last year, like last June. And I think because it's Louis, I'm not big on like <laughs> name brands. 
So I was like, but you know what? I'm not going to spend $12.99 when I already have a wallet. So this is what we're going to be using instead. I don't even know if I'm keeping the box. The box is very efficient. It's good quality and it's maybe use it for something else. Anyway, let's do a quick look at it. Um, it definitely has, it's, it's cute. It's a good color. Uh, and, oh, I already had one of the things in there. And then take that out. It's got a coin purse, which is great because I always need a coin purse. Uh, and then it says something like made in Paris, France. I don't know, child. I don't know. Okay. I'm not here for all that. I just am glad I didn't have to spend the extra $12.99. So now we're going to go back to our old one where the money resides, where the money resides, which is currently in Dollar Tree. Hey, what the what? What a money reside. What a money reside. What a money reside. What a money reside. So we're going to grab our money out of Dollar Tree. Normally we stuff $260, which this should be $260. This one may be a little longer because we are going, you know, switching out systems and all of that. So let's see. Yesterday, my sister needed to change for something, which works out because I could use that money for um, giving. What? Okay, let me get my money together first, you guys. We have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 210, 20, 30, 40, 50, 55, 60. Exactly like I said. We have $260. <clears throat> so let's just put our money out. Pumpkin, you gotta go. I need all the room. Let's go over what I have as dividers. Some are for the main part and some are just for extra. So gifts, because I'm finding that lately I do want to buy people things. I don't know if this is the holiday spirit, but I've been wanting to do that. Gas. Gas is definitely a main category. Groceries, definitely a main category. <laughs> personal is now going to be, um, so, uh, personal is now going to be self-care. And a dining out is going to be allowance because honestly, you guys, <laughs> all I, I'll go over these with you guys in a minute. All I do is uh, use my eating out, my allowance money to eat out. And that's just facts. So I'm just going to make it dining out. Plus, I didn't see an allowance on the paperwork, but that's just basically I can use that allowance money for whatever I want. So let's get to restuffing these. So gas gets 80, 20, 40, 60, 80. Yeah. <clears throat> it's just going to take our gas, going to flip it and then put our money. Then groceries also gets 80, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80. 20, 40, 60, 70, 80 dollars into groceries. And let's flip that. Then we have personal, which is self-care, which gets 40, 20, 30, 40. Okay. And then dining out, which is basically allowance, <laughs> gets $20. So these... All can go into the main wallet. Jeez. Oh, giving also needs to go in here. So, where's my giving? Did they have giving? I think. Okay, we can't see. So, we have gifts, deposits, household clothing. Okay, I think gifts, because I didn't see a giving one. Gifts is giving. So, gifts ha gets 10, 15, 20. $20 for gifts. I wonder if I have five singles. 
one, two, three, four, five. I'm going to take five singles out of our reserve money and put the five dollars back over there because sometimes it's just easy to give somebody a dollar if you see them on the street, two dollars, whatever your heart is feeling. So, ten, oh my gosh, ten, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. That's gifts, it's getting twenty dollars. Okay, and that also stays that also stays in the wallet. Alright, so our everyday cash envelopes. Actually, it's kind of small. Wait, let me if y'all are doing this, let me see if it actually does fit in this. See, like it does fit in there. Which is great. It does fit in there, you guys. So if you like it and you you think it's gonna fit, but I feel like for me it's gonna be a struggle trying to look through. Like it's not it's not enough space for me. It's not it's just not enough space for me. So I'm just gonna put it in here, which I have lots of compartments to choose from. So let's go here with it in the middle. Oh no, that's not a long one. Let's go here. Let's see if I have more room. Yeah. So now they're in there and I got more room to dig like that. I need that. I need that in my life. And so you see that I have $20 left. And that is going to go to our normal HOA, right? So we have HOA. And that's in here. Should be the very first big envelope. Yep. And that's going to get $20. <clears throat> So we add that, we're going to now have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 30. We have 230, slowly but surely getting there, you guys. Surely but surely, slowly but surely getting there. So my HOA is paid up until March of 2023, I believe. And so my HOA, if it doesn't change, is normally $44. And that's going to be for $20. Each month, so times 12. That ain't it. This is exactly why I don't like calculating now. <laughs> Just being honest. So, we really try, we're really trying to get to 528. We have 230, I think I said. Nope, that ain't right. Oh my gosh. <laughs> 528 minus 230. So, we're halfway there. Does that seem right to you? 528 minus 230. No, two ninety eight. So we have two ninety eight left. So about three hundred dollars. I don't know if we're gonna get there by March, but anything is better than nothing, right? That's where my head is at. Okay, so that's it for our HOA. That's all we really stuff in this. Oh, lies. Okay, so in here, we're doing a savings challenge right now, which is all the money is going here, and we're doing a scratch off mystery scratch off challenge. So. We do have a bit of money. 20, 30, 40, 50, 55, 60. We now have $63. We still have $63. So we, we didn't take any more. Okay, so I'm going to get a coin. We'll use this little hair penny. And I think we're going to go here. Let's see what we got. I'm trying to be super decisive because I'm not. Oh, girl, I thought I saw 40. I was gonna be like, no! <laughs> so this is ten dollars. And you guys, this is actually really weird for me because normally I thought these were cool or whatever, but normally I'm just like, just put the money away. <laughs> Say what you got and that's it. We're not we're not trying to do all of this. We just this is it is kind of fun, but I'm just like, I could just this one's fun because it's a mystery. So I like that. Um all right, so we have 10, actually, you know what? We're not even counting. I guess that's even more fun if you just don't bother counting and you just kind of mysteriously figure out what it is. So I might scratch this one more time, but before I commit to doing that, which I need to update this. Oh, so I'm not even going to update this because I don't want to know. <laughs> I want it to actually be a mystery. So birthday has another scratch off. So let's scratch off birthday. Girl, we just going in. Oh, please. Okay. <laughs> Every time I see this one on the 10, I think it says 40. I'm like, come on. Give me your girl a break. All right. So this is $10. And I'm a little OCD. So I feel like this whole thing needs to be off properly. So we're going to grab $10 from here. Like so, like that. 
And then we're going to do one more scratch from the other one. And then everything else is going to go to, I think, bulk toiletries this week. Actually, no. Facts. Not okay. Can I do that? Um, so, birthday is there. Oh, I got a mess. Uh, okay. So, we have 20, 30. Oof, girl, Lenny. All right, so let's, we're not, I'm a very afraid. So, we're not going to scratch any more on this. <laughs> we're just going to leave this alone for now because we still need to put some money back to the credit card. So, $10, $20, $30 is going to the credit card because we are still trying to pay the credit card off. And so, the last three categories I have with me are household, sorry, household, clothing, and deposit. I need new fall stuff like boots and work pants and sweaters and things like that. I haven't completely decided on what I'm buying, but I'm supposed to be taking it out of my normal transfer of sinking funds, but I haven't done that yet. Household is just like if I need something for the household, like bulk toiletries or something and this is deposit which means back to the bank so right now this $30 is going in the back to the bank category because that needs to go to the credit card for payments and this remainder 5 10 11 12 $13 is going to household which is basically when I'm going to Sam's Club to buy bulk stuff and this is going in oh, new wallet I'm like where's what this is going to go, and I'm going to take this blue off the tag. I, I don't know. <laughs> this is going to go on the other side because these are not ones that normally get stuff all the time, but we need them. But I really like how this is looking all stuffed in there. And then I'll put my change. So that wasn't too bad, you guys. So those are what we're doing now. For all of you who made it, I know it's kind of long for me that's, you know, as far as cash saving videos goes. For all of you who made it, I am actually doing a unstuffing of a purchase that I just got and I'm super excited about it. So let me show you. It just came in the mail today and I was like, oh, I gotta do my cash saving so I open it. So look at it now. I did cut here just to make sure that I was looking at the right thing. I didn't look at anything yet either, but I have happy mail and it says, thank you for supporting my small business. I truly am excited about this. So now I'm going to go ahead. As soon as I saw this item, I was like, I need it. I don't know why I needed it, but I needed it. <laughs> look at it in there. It's so cute. So let's start with, thank you, Tara, for your purchase. I hope you love your order. Happy budgeting. It is from Budgeting with Tiana Chanel. You guys, you see her Instagram right there? I will link her Instagram down below. She has an Etsy shop. I will link that down below as well. I believe she has a, yeah, because I follow her now. She has a YouTube channel. I will link that down below. I believe she's more active on Instagram and Etsy. Look, her Etsy is as made by Tiana. So Tiana Chanel, thank you so much. She was super nice about it. And she actually let, I didn't have to go through Etsy. She was taking DM orders on Instagram at the time. So I didn't even know order all of this stuff. <laughs> so I'm really excited for it because what girl? I ordered two things and this wasn't it. <clears throat> all right, let's go. So I love the thing. Y'all know I'm a sucker for packaging. This thank you card is everything. So cute, good quality paper. Y'all know I used to own a business. I'm all about it. Oh, look at this. Valentine's Day. Don't act up. I'm going to need you to let the people see the goodness. Really? What are we doing? Okay. Okay, Android. Don't make us look bad. It's making us look bad. Anyway, I'm going to just read it to y'all. <laughs> it says Valentine's Day Savings Challenge. You put your goal and, you know, you check off in your amounts. This is so cute because even if you're a single or you're in a couple, you could just take yourself out to eat. Y'all know I'm all about these solo dates out here in this world. I mean, people could take me on dates too, but still. I love me a good solo date. I'm mad that's not focusing. It's really agitating to me. And then this is such nice quality. This is a category goal date amount balance. So it looks like it's a tracking sheet, which is so cute. Like you can say what you're saving for, what your goal is, and how much you're depositing in, whether it's in, you're taking in or out. So you could basically use this for anything. I'm assuming because it is a laminated piece, you should be able to use uh, a magic marker on this and it should be able to 
write on it and then also reuse it for your next goal. Loving that. Oh, I got another thousand K. Y'all know I love these because I will <laughs> put some stickers on them and make them my own. But I love having them because I have goals. Like I need to save a thousand dollars. It's going to make sense in this next one. Now, you guys, it's so funny. I don't usually have credit card debt. I'm usually consumer debt free. But I just put money in my credit card. That's why I took it out. <laughs> <laughs> so but if you're interested all of these should be in her shop this is um i assume they're in her shop goodbye credit card debt you get the card you put your current amount your expected payoff date um why is this doing this <laughs> is it better it's a little better okay and then or it's in my imagination anyway so then you can I guess you choose what your current amount is, your expected payoff date, and you would like, I guess, color or circle these in as you get to where you're going. Love this for me. I probably, I can use this. I can use this because I currently just have current credit card debt now. Now, those are things I didn't even purchase. So I appreciate you so, so much for sending these to me, Tiana. These are super cute, well-made, loving it. The only thing that's not laminated is the Valentine's Day one, but that's okay. If I wanted to, I can laminate it myself because I have a laminator, <laughs> but it's really cute. Even still, it's pretty decent cardstock. Kind of, it's a little thinner, but I think it's just like a one-time use thing. Love that. Okay, so in the box, in the back here, you'll see she put cute little pinky things. Okay, love that for me. And I'm going to try not to get them all over my floor. But look at this. All right, so these are the actual two items that I picked up. Aren't they just so gorgeous? So they're a savings challenge, you guys. I am going to, I, I'm trying to decide which one I want to open. I, I think I'm going to open this one. So I'm going to open this one. Look how nice this package. Love it. I am going to have to cut this because I'm not going to struggle. <laughs> we don't have that kind of time. All right. And loving the gold rings on this. <clears throat> oh, we love her stickers. Super cute. Oh, and then she was smart. She put an elastic band around it so that it would, I guess I could use this in future as well to keep it closed so that it wouldn't go all wonky, wonky. And this is super cute. Now, this is a 1K savings challenge. And what I like to do is like, I, I love the saving challenges I do. And I love that this is laminated and that I can keep using it. So as I do the 1K, I can keep using it and keep going. So let me see though. Y'all know I'm a little weird <laughs> about my money being folded. I did not realize this was like, didn't fit a whole dollar. <laughs> Y'all know. I did not realize that I would have to fold the money. I really didn't. Or else I probably wouldn't buy it. Y'all know I'm weird. I think it's kind of disrespectful to fold your money. But this is so cute that I'm just going to do it. Now, if it's something I had to do on a daily basis, I wouldn't. No, it's not for me. <laughs> it's not for me. But since I don't have to look at these every day, I don't have to pull them out every day. They're just for when I'm saving. It's just super cute. Just so know that. If you're one of me like who doesn't like to fold your money, this is going to be a fold your money situation. But I'm not even going to add. I'm assuming that all these envelopes are different values and that they will add up to $1,000. I really love that because it gives you the option of having a day where you have a lot or a day where you don't have a lot and you can just put in as you go. So I haven't this. I think what I might do is like, let's say this is 50 and only have 20. I will put 20 in here and I'm not moving to the next envelope. <laughs> until I finish putting 50 because I will get lost like I'll be like unless there's some way for me to keep track of oh this one is done I would just keep going until I got 50 in here and then moved on to the 75 and the 45 and so on and so forth but isn't that the cutest design anyway y'all so I love this I love this Tiana this is beautiful the quality feels amazing and what I love most about it is that I can use it over and over again y'all know I like a thrifty find this is super cute, and um, it's definitely going to help me get some of my goals. Now, if you stayed this long, I truly do appreciate you. You can be entered to win this one. I think this is just as beautiful. I am not going to open it, 
but this is the one I fell in love with at first but then I was like oh this is kind of cute too I like the little greens um this one is for one of my subscribers so if you are already subscribed to my channel or you're now subscribed to my channel and you have been watching for a while or whatever you just go ahead and link down below which one of my videos are your favorites is it the cash stuffing is it the home vlogs the decor vlogs the um Anything I do, just just pick one. Just tell me what your favorite was and leave a red heart emoji. That's it. That's it. And then when I, I'll respond to your comment and I'll get all your information when you win. This video will probably go out on Monday or Tuesday of this week. So I will be choosing someone by Sunday of the following week. So Sunday the 20... Nope. The 30th on Sunday, the 30th, the day before Halloween, I will pick a winner. So it gives you more than enough time to watch the video and get your comment in. So I hope you guys, and thank you so much. I really do appreciate you. I have had y'all been rocking, some of y'all been rocking with me from Tara Gay Nicole channel. So um, I do appreciate you all. And when I do see something that I think would be of use to you, which is just another 1K challenge and saving is, I love the idea of saving. It is one of the top things you should be doing. Even if you're paying off debt, I still think you should save. So I hope that one of my subbies win this. But I'm like, I want it. I'm the, I am the worst. I like it to be somebody I really know, really has been always commenting and loving on it. But sometimes it doesn't go like that. And I would just be doing a random drawing. All right, you guys. Thanks so much for watching. Remember, in order to be great, you have to be grateful. I'm super duper grateful for you. Have a wonderful, blessed day. Don't forget to... Check out Tiana if you want any of these. She's coming out with new designs all the time. I see them on Instagram. So make sure you check out Budgeting with Tiana Chanel. Um, I will link all her information down in the box below. All right, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Have a wonderful, blessed day. Remember, great um, faith over fear. And all things are always working out for our good for those who believe.